Detroit Pistons, Sadiq Bay breaks another record. This time he breaks NBA rookie record. Let's talk about it. Check out the Detroit Pistons talk playlist out. Make sure to hit that subscribe button, bell icon button, share the video. And it says Bay, uh, Sadiq Bay is in the record books again. Rookie Sadiq Bay has been an outstanding reading from PistonPower.com. Shout out to them. Outstanding for the Detroit Pistons this season and was able to put himself into the rookie, into the record books again as a rookie. Bay has already broken the record for made threes by Detroit Pistons rookie and is getting closer to the all-time NBA record as well. He is at the very top of the, an elite list of rookie shooters when it comes to accuracy, volume, and is likely to finish in the top five of Rookie of the Year voting after being selected 19th overall in the 2020 draft. Uh, forget about last draft. Um, Bay absolutely looks like one of the biggest drafts still in Piston history as he's already a polished defender who can rebound and shoot the three. And a lot of people ain't really seen he can post up too, man. I, I said this about Sadiq Bay. When he starts adding more elements to his offense game, Bay can end up being multiple. He already got, he's got an opportunity to post up, he can shoot. Man, but Bay went into video game mode last night against the Cavaliers, hitting six of eight from long range three point in the first quarter, um, breaking yet another record along the way. Detroit Pistons, Sadiq Bay breaks another record. Bay recorded his fifth game this season with at least six made three pointers, which is the all time record for rookies in the NBA. Bay now has 132 made three pointers for the season. He's just 55 away from tying an all time rookie record. He would need to make nearly four per game from here out. Um, so it's a long shot, but when you consider that Bay came into the league viewed as a defensive specialist, the Detroit Pistons have uh, been ecstatic about his display of shooting. Bay was good three-point shooting in college, but no one saw I've seen it coming. Stop it. I told you guys he was still in the drive. I'm going to remind you on the community type. Pistons have something special in Bay, who is not only shattering Pistons rookie records from shooting, but is starting to, you know, get into the NBA all-time rookie records as well. And then, man, I mean, I said this about Hell Burton and Bay. Nobody wanted to listen to me. Nobody wanted to listen to me about Hell Burton and Bay. I said when I seen Hell Burton shot, I said, you know, he gonna be able to shoot on the next level. I really don't have no, um, I really don't have no issues about him shooting at the next level. And Bay did this in college. He did his in college. I was not surprised, bro. He shot 41%, almost 42% from three in college. 46% from the field. College game is slowed down. And they play zone, so everybody got a chance to play. They could be, be good defenders. That's why it's an amateur sport. You go to the next level, it's out more open. Just had to get opportunities. You know, you put him in the open with space, he was going to shoot the ball well. There was no doubt in my mind about him, man. And... I was huge on him and Hale Burton, Maxi. You know, Bay is just a good player, man. When they started to really show his repertoire as far as posting up, show his repertoire around, it's what he can do as an all-around as all around player. You know, he can spot up. He can get you in the post. I mean, that's why he's going to be three foot long, be our solid four for a long time to go. It's a long time. He can play some four in some situations. You know, you put him in a situation where you keep him with Jeremy Grant, you got two good players, two good defenders, you know. You add Jalen Green and his team on the fast track. You know, people got mad because I apologize to Killian Hayes. I mean, shit, he's a good player. They got a good team going here. You know, and if they're able to add a guy like Jalen, even if Evan Mobley, they would add him. But Jalen Green is the guy. They ever add him to the mix. And Pistons gonna, the Pistons are going to be, they're going to be like the Celtics. The only difference is they they got they going to be more consistent defending. Team defending, but... um. I'm not surprised, man. I seen it coming. You know, they said, well, nobody's seen this coming. I seen it coming. You know, I got the receipts, man, but hell of a basketball player, hell of a shooter. I mean, when people see he what his post game about, man, I knew he was more than 3D. Are you surprised how he slid, slid all in the 19? You know, but, you know, it is what it is. I think his age was a huge thing. When he only 22 years old. You know, I didn't understand why that was a huge thing, but. Shout out to Shadiq Bay. You know, I said he was going to be the still of the draft. I know I can't be what I know. I know basketball. That's my number one sport as far as, as, far as knowing it. But shout out to the Charlotte product. Let me know what you guys think. Don't forget me on Twitter, Facebook, Instagram. All my links there. If you need to advertise your business on the channel, video requests to chop, chop it up. My links there. I want to make a financial donation. Cash app CJ Good 313. That's in the description. PayPal link there as well, too. Best way to donate. Share the video. Don't forget to check the Detroit Piston Talk playlist. For more videos like this, one time for the one time, Mercy Sports Talk. Peace.